Hello everyone, welcome to Text Valley. So in our previous lecture, we discussed about how we can deploy application or microservice in Cloud Foundry. So in that, uh, in that lecture, uh, I told uh, there are two ways to deploy the application in Cloud Foundry. First is using Spring Tool Shoot and other is using CFCLI, which is a command line tool. Now we have learned how to deploy the application. So in our today's lecture, we will discuss about how we can manage application on Cloud Foundry using CFCLI command line tool. To manage the application on Cloud Foundry, there are two ways. First is using Cloud Foundry user interface. So this user interface is the interface which is provided by Cloud Foundry uh, website itself when we create the developer account on Cloud Foundry and we log in so a dashboard a dashboards open on the Cloud Foundry website itself and from there, there on that dashboards uh, of Cloud Foundry websites we can manage the applications we can increase the instance of uh, a running application we can stop the running application we can start the run, running application uh, we can delete the applications we can see the logs of application so uh, all the applications uh, management related operations we can do using cloud foundry interface itself but today we are not going to discuss uh, how to manage the application using cloud foundry interface so we will discuss how to manage the application on cloud foundry using command line cfcli tool so uh, in this tool uh, i will tell you about the different commands by which we can manage the application on cloud foundry so basically i created three sets of commands but in today's lecture i will tell you the first set of commands So in today's lecture, uh, we are going to discuss all these commands. Let me give you the brief of all these commands. So CF apps, uh, this, this command provides the list of all application currently deployed in a target space on Cloud Foundry. CF app, this command display the health and the status of a particular app. Suppose we want to see the health and status of demo app so we can write cf app and application name cf push already we discussed in the last lecture so we are not going to discuss it today's lecture so cf scale is a command which is used to increase the number of instance of particular application disk space or memory limit for an application so for example, if uh, we deployed our application with a single instance and the memory size is 1 GB and disk size is 1 GB. So we can increase the uh, application memory instance and disk size by using this command CF scale. So from 1 GB to uh, 2 GB or from one instance to we can increase three or four instance of an application by using this command. The syntax of CF scale is CF scale and app name, then hyphen M to increase the memory and hyphen I to increase the instance. CF delete. So CF delete command is used to delete a particular application. CF rename is used to rename the particular application. CF start to start an application which is stopped on Cloud Foundry and CF stop to stop any particular application okay so let's move to the commands so the first command uh, was cf apps so here we go so cf app gives the list of application currently deployed on the cloud foundry so one application is started and one application into the stop state. So the second command was 
cf app and app name so it will tell the health and status of an application so i did some mistake i given the wrong app name so there it should be you as well so this cf app command will give the status and health information of an application so here is the health information so CP utilization by this app is 0.2% memory consumed is 115 MB and this space con uh, consumed is 130.6 MB out of 1 GB so this is the health and the status report of particular application by using CF app so next command was CF scale scale then app name and hyphen i for number of instances so currently if you see the number of instances one only so if we will write two then it will increase the number of instances So it says okay so let's see the uh, how many instance currently running of this application using CF app okay here we go we can see the instances are two and the health of both the instances is this so now the two instance of that particular app is running so this way we can use the cf scale we can also increase the memory and the disk size of an our application using the same command okay what was the next command cf stop so let's stop particular application So application has been stopped. Let's see the status of app. CF app. So status of application is stopped. Okay. So next command was cf start, cf start and then app name. So application is starting. So we given the two instances. So it's starting the both instances of that application so it's given successful so application has been started successfully okay so now the last command cf rename And then app name was so we give the new name we see so here we go application name has been changed Let's see all application, CF apps. So yeah, the application name has been changed from V2 to V3. So I think one command left that is CF delete. And 
then app name so any app name you can give and then enter abc so it will delete the abc app so i'm not going to delete currently running application so that's why i'm not showing but it's a pretty simple command uh, you can write cf delete and then app name so these were the com uh, these were the commands we want to discuss today's lecture thank you very much please don't forget to uh, to subscribe our channel text valley Thanks, thanks a lot.